instantly snap pick the Enigma. Something Fear ran a lot of its Star Ladder with great success. I right away fly struts up. At least in a pop of clarity. Neutrals are going to be stacked up though, and they are making their move on the mid lane now as PPD engages. This is how they look to shut down the Invoker just right off the bat. Give them the old Seal Club. Oh, kill him off. Uh, Sumail continues to apply pressure. Yeah. Crit could be in trouble here. There is access to the stun. PD wants to be right on top of him before he goes. Now he's just going to let the stun fly. Slows down, rolls a little to the left, and the Nyx is forced to stun him as well. But while that was happening, they do get the kill in Universe. Well, does Sumail look to go? No, uh, not quite level 6. Oh, they are going to try to set up here. He does manage to banish himself at the right time. Dodging the Oracle Nuke, but still gets pulled on by Crit. Sunstrike not needed. Four heroes just smack down Sumail. That was some heavy commitment. I think that's his only chance of survival though, is going for... Oh, no tell. Wants to go for the solo kill here on Universe. He does get off the first rocket barrage, but Universe gonna be tough to keep eyes on through the trees. He's not getting the rocket damage on him as Universe continues to run circles around him. Even turn this one the other way. If no tail's not careful, again with the rocket barrage, Universe continue to kite him, and now reinforcements are on the way. Four napalm stacks up. Universe is gonna go for this one. Has no tail been completely baited out? One more rocket brush, but the Firefly is going. No tail's gonna oh, drop six shit. sticky napalm charges before he finally goes down. Can the Oracle turn it around? Yes, he sun strike not needed, so Fi at least salvages it, but no tail played by Universe in the top lane. The black hole and air ball. Fear a bit too slow, and now Moon's gonna look to turn on him. Is there any detection? Just needs that one vendetta strike would be enough for a kill, almost certainly. Worming his way around the side of the fight as Arteezy pops the lichen through throw shapeshift and gets aggressive here running down the earth spear bit by bit and while that was happening fear also falls so it ends up being a one for one bottom but it's a black hole committed for that as well as a lichen Radiant's shapeshift middle tower is under and they're not done just yet all right no tails back in he has the call down available creeps here to tank the rocket barrage damage universe kiting him toying with him and they're also making a go on the mid lane sun strike come through they get two male Miracle getting all kinds of help from his team. Sumail, basically nothing. And anything. Yeah. But it actually works for OG, whereas it just usually does not work for the NA team. They're gonna find Sumail again! Oh man, he has not had a fun ma match up here. He's fights. He's been... He's been I getting his love. He's yeah. been trying to walk around Radiant get kills, but he's just always a tad bit too slow, I think. Oh, no tell. He's poked out his pretty old man head. And EG are hunting him. They bloodlust the Lycan. They're gonna run him down. The Wolves are here to tank up some of that rocket barrage damage. Arteezy will end up getting the kill. No Tail was expecting more help than what he got, but he had already committed his combo. Didn't have anything to deter the ET dive and or the EG dive rather. Universe just hugging his tower, staying close, staying get safe. Sunstrike ready. Uh, I think they need the Vendetta hit here to get the kill. No, they're just gonna go for the straight stun with the Impale and Orc follow up. We'll secure it. Last hit goes to fly. 16 minutes. And yeah, you can see that it's this Bloodlust max build from PPD. You're dead. Uh, yep. They found him. It'll be Roasted Ogre for dinner. So he's going Scepter. Not opting for the blink at all. Really good for the high ground. They did catch out No-Tail though. Another death for the carry of OG. He's really been stacking up for him and... Yeah. It's Drug City. Yeah, and uh, that again goes back to Universe, where he's just able to bait oh. them out. But EG on the high ground, this is the ideal position to start this fight off. Meatball cut through, the look at it! So two massive damage for Miracle off the bat, obliterating the OG as well as the Batrider. Fears on the run, that's three down, just like that. EG, they thought they had a nice catch there, but the Carapace comboed with the Invoker. So no, they also get the fourth catch there. OG wasting no time and taking objectives here. They're going to grab the tower. With the Ford Spirits, do they get out? They're gonna roll away, the lasso will wrangle in Moon, but... Oh, trading your three position for a fight like that, that's something they'll do any day of the week. Tornado, covering the path of retreat, they get Moon. Oh gee, delighted with that. Kinda kill him during it. They need Gyrocopter to get more farm too. Oh, OG on the move again! 
And they're going to get the jump again, potentially, with Moon coming in. He stuns Arteezy off the bat. The meatball rolls through. Arteezy trying to morph through this time. But it looks like he may go down. He sprints to the right. Can he make it out safely? He will. The Black Hole for Fear comes in. Catches out Moon. They keep the Lycan alive. He comes back in. Much as that third hero. Sumail cleaning it up. That's four for EG. It's going to be a team with this time. Well, they didn't get the perfect initiation from the Invoker Nyx combo. And that made all the difference for EG. Like, that means you're not going to get any flak damage off. Which is very bad. Obviously. But when you go tanky building, you still have to run away. It's oh, Universe. He's tracking Moon. He finds him right as the Cockroach squirms away from his team. And... Brings him into Sumail for a quick kill. Pushing down the top lane. So this is Invoker's job. He can stall a lot with the with the scepter. Or 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 so OG hopes. <laughs> yeah. Well they smoke and very quickly the smoke will end. Arteezy though is gonna be Astral. Nice banish there by Sumail to keep him alive through the majority of that damage. Then they're gonna Greaves and try to turn. BK comes out from oh, Fear. He's committed it very early. EG, not a very good initiation here as Arteezy will end up going down. And it's a dominating streak for him. They don't even lose crit. He's able to squirm back towards the base. May survive in the end. Dyer's Looks like he barely escapes courtesy of the Oracle. No. Common sense is not the first word that comes to mind. <laughs> Smoke from EG though. They look to break the base here. Sunstrike flies out, EG get aggressive, they march up onto the hill and the Lurker begins to do his work. Batrider jumping in, but he jumps into the boulder coming back for the silence, so not able to find the lasso opportunity just yet. Now the call down deployed, EG gonna have to pop some BKB soon. First one is a pretty decent success, but not enough to finish off the Jero who makes it back to the wall. Sumail wants these kills so damn bad, but he's just not getting them. And now OG might be able to turn this one around until the old man comes in! He reels in three! OG now being routed after the black hole. Can they finish them off though? Miracle's so low, almost dead to one lab of tech from Universe. He's gonna buy back, but this gives Arteezy space and time to finally almost crack through a later Rex. They force out the Invoker buyback. Side back on them, Hark! Eviscerates the like in the first time. Can they kill him a second time is the question. He's just trying to walk away, but against Cold Snap, Ice Wall, that's not going to happen. Again, the Miracle Invoker holding on, but that was a costly hold. I think EG might have to wait for another day. Well, they've had a lot of other days. Oh, there's an Invoker. Here we go. Looking for the initiation, and it's immediately perched off. But Moon does get hexed up. Where's the follow-up, though? Sumail did not manage to get off his DKP from the looks of things. He's gonna go splat off the bat, does Radiant have the Aegis for round number two, and Fear looking Radiant to- Oh, he already popped the black hole, but they have created space for Arteezy, who's managed to at least get a Faye or a Ranger X out of this. Roll for though, magnetize onto three heroes from crit. A lot of damage coming out as No Tail commits into it. Diving forward, they are gonna bring down PPD as well as Sumail. They only got a Ranger X. They need more out of this. Universe going for the BKB TP out. Will he make it in time? Yes, he will. But the Batrider not so lucky. Three heroes down. EG arranged Rex for all that. And they lost the Aegis. Issue right here, right now. Moon burrowing, setting up shops at the, at the damn Rex. And now stunning PPD under his own tier fours. Very aggressive positioning. Arteezy's going to engage onto no tail. Pops the BKB, goes to work with this. The Satanic, the heal from the Oracle, keeping him in fighting shape, forcing Arteezy back. OG looking to take the series down 2 0. And a very worthy adversary if they could pull it off. They move forward, Tornado again, that one's going to connect on two, just narrowly missing on PPD as well. Universe will be down Dyer's for the count, dead tower. for 75, and Miracle immediately straight onto Tier 4 Towers. Moon's going to move forward, and sets up Chubb again, really is a, just a mobile lurker at this stage. Has a Carapace ready to go, and Dyer's that's going to keep Fear on his toes for the time being. They pummel him, trying to take him down, but the Deafening Blast connects with all of EG. Forcing their heroes back, Arteezy completely chained stun, cleaned up, finished off, he has to buy back. No tail, still alive, healthy in the front line, so gonna buy back on Higgs. OG keeps on going, keep for the throne. EG, every single buyback committed pretty much at this point. They got a hold here and they need more than just a hold. They need to go back the other way and grab some objectives of their own. But Miracle muscles up onto Sumail, continues to commit forward. RTZ trying to go ahead, quick ghost walk to retreat. No doubt the focus of EG, but they can't even bring him down. He's kept alive, he goes invis and then backs away. There's the Destiny Blast once again, turning the fight around. Perhaps RTZ lays in a no town, will have to fend off. And, oh, then they lose the Invoker. He melts, and it's time for more fighting from OG. A triple buyback in Poker Journal, and the Oracle already joining the fight. Four heroes down for EG, and at long last, they've exposed the throne.
What's the They are the gonna side? take this. That thing is that thing is Radiant absurd. Victory. The next stun? Yeah. With Octarine? Oh. I think like the 5.5. 5.5 with a two second stun? That's what's that's what Mr. Parker is saying. Roughly 5.5 seconds. They they just like they between have... that and the invoker, like yeah. you